You guys are going to the Dreadnought now. Actually, I think it's one of my favorite missions. I don't remember, though. Are you alright, Austin? I'm fine. Alex, what do we know about these harvesters? Not much. We know they can tear a ship to pieces, and even the board are scared of them. Totally resistant to assimilation. Well, better that we get a move on and not find out. Yeah, definitely. No, I, oh, I got my helmet. That's what I was after. Okay. <laughs> I sure hope Tuvok is right about this gunship being operational. I don't think I want to come face to face with those harvesters. Tuvok's usually right. We've got plenty of time to board the ship and fire. After this, we should be free and clear. Yeah, but you know what they say. What? If you see a light at the end of the wormhole, it's probably a photon torpedo. <laughs> Man, Joe, sometimes you make me think Murphy must have been a bullion. Who's Murphy? You know, Murphy's Law. Ah, trust me, you'd like him. Okay. It's gonna be guns. And also holodeck. If we can. Better make it quick. <laughs> took like all the guns. Nothing for anyone else. Let's see, what's, what do these guys take since they took everything? Well, they took their guns. Oh, they apparently uh, are going to the ship unarmed because I'm a jerk to kill the weapon. Oh. Open up the holodeck. Damn it. I like how we're all just walking here normally. Hey, how you doing, Shell? Sorry, sir. I'm kind of busy. <laughs> no, you're not. Dude, he's got a he's got a suit on now. All right. Oh, I guess I'm in the front. Yeah, the leader. Coordinates received and lost in, sir. Energize. You know, I like I like big gunships. <laughs> it just it's just a fun proposition for me. Gravity's a little light here. Should have brought grav boots. Power to this area must be partially out. What are those? Looks like fighters. Fighters? I thought this ship didn't have a crew. Maybe they're automated. <laughs> We do not have time for idle speculation. We should proceed. I wonder what happens when you jump out. Cool, it's a death cut scene. I'm <laughs> just floating out into space. <laughs> you lost. <laughs> That's funny. You performed inadequately. Oh yeah, we know. We just, let me just go back so we don't have to hear all the dialogue again. Ah, oh, cool fighters. Move it. What? They always sound so angry. The door won't open. Like I thought, power's out. It is likely we would be blown out through the hull breach should we open the door just yet. We must restore the environmental integrity of the hangar bay before we continue. It looks like there's a computer console on the upper level. Maybe we could restore power there. Mr. Monroe, find a way up there and see what you can do. Yes, Mr. Monroe. I like how he tried to open the door and then basically Tuvok said, Oh, well, you know, we can, we will get blown out the door and stuff. Alright, well, I gotta find a way up there. Well, there's definitely an elevator. I'm guessing the puzzle is you gotta jump on stuff. Because I don't really recall this. Oh, I see it. Uh, yeah, that's how you do it. Okay. <clears throat> it's because of the, the low gravity I'm able to do this. A little bit of FPS platforming. Oh, damn it. Uh, I gotta go back. Alright, up here. And right there. And then we just start heading over here. And another gunship with guns. Well, 
Well, it is a gunship, but you know what I'm talking about. Here we go. Containment field. Environmental settings are normalizing. Good. We can take these helmets off. No. Leave them on until we get to the control room, and I can secure environmental integrity to the entire vessel. Mr. Chell, you may now open the door. Mr. Monroe, lead the way. Yes, sir. What's this over here? <laughs> Nothing, I guess. Okay. Apparently the ship is now falling apart. Do these boxes do anything? I guess not. I guess they just blow up. That's a harvester? I don't know. It looked bigger before we killed it. Let us hope, Mr. Chell. That you do not mistake one of us for a harvester. <laughs> yeah, Chell. You jerk. Mr. Chell, if you would. The health energy terminals look different on every ship. It's actually kind of cool. Come on, Chell. Don't be such a sissy. Alright, everyone on board. Oh man, they're just going to walk slowly onto here, aren't they? One at a time. Hey, what's that person doing over there? Uh, I want to take this phaser and put it to my head for, <laughs> before this taking so long. Yes. We cannot move until... Yeah, I guess, I'm guess i guessing it's because the engine wasn't really capable of uh, path, pathing like four people through the same little door, so it doesn't want to have time. Oh my god. How many people do we have? <laughs> you know, I thought there was a big dreadnought or something, or there's a big harvester ship heading towards our ship. You know, so we're just taking our sweet, the sweet time. Uh, man, all right, let's keep going. Oh, there's a laser there. There's some serious damage here. To do that much damage to this ship, we must get to the elevator at the end of this hall. Yeah, we're taking a really long time. Oh, some stasis pods. The door's being jammed by something on the other side. And blood. Oh, one more. By the way, there, this is. I guess there was a crew after all. A small crew, perhaps. So where are they? Harvesters. I'm sure we'll find out soon. The control room is still one deck above this one. We must get to that elevator. Monroe, find a place. See if the debris can be blown clear. So, uh. find a layout of this deck. Sadlos, you and I will attempt to force the jammed door. Monroe, Murphy, see if there's an alternate route. Yeah, there is one. Right there. Should you tell me something? Nope, I guess not. Okay, let's go. I don't know, sir. I don't think this door can be opened without moving hey, whatever's blocking Alex found it the on the other side. Shaft. Yes, he did. What is your assessment? No good, sir. The molecular density and tensile strength of this material is so high, my dead packs would barely scratch the surface. Looks like I there's a main room got around on the other side. Monroe Last got around. Monroe, see what's jamming the door. The chair. Unfortunately, that doesn't really work. Uh, I forgot what button. I forgot. Oh, there you go. There's the control panel. That got destroyed. All right. <clears throat> so basically, the puzzle here is that we have to um, figure out how to make the gun fire upon that, uh, which it's been a very long time. Oh wait, sorry, my bad, it's right here. 
Okay, wait, we gotta go. Yeah, this one's this one's actually kind of a tedious one, I remember this. Yeah, that one's turning it. There we go. It's like very minuscule movements. I don't know what the hell this laser is for. Uh, definitely not surgery, because it's not uh, accurate at all. <laughs> there we go. Okay, do you like the nuclear density ish thing? Alright, uh, it's just about pointing there. Needs to be a little more thing to the side here. Oops, too much. Wow, I just like started doing like big ass steps. Is that enough? Okay, that's definitely good enough. Alright. Wonder if I could kill the people who go through this door. We did it. Nice work, Monroe. Let's try it. Sound your doctor's reasoning, Hansen. Good work. <laughs> he got killed. <laughs> he, he was even standing in it, and he knew. <laughs> that, that was funny. Deductive reasoning, Hansen. Good work. I, like, why would you stand there? Definitely a medical lab. Doesn't look like they even got a chance to use it. Why are they talking through the walls? Whatever, let me let me go, uh Oh damn it. They all have to come here. It's like an escort mission, you know? If if I was doing this on my own it would have been so much more different. Oh here he comes. I feel like melting him, honestly. This is the slowest you've ever gone on any uh, any mission, honestly. <laughs> yeah, this is the one where we're actually technically timed with. Oh, Shell has to open it. I see how it is. <clears throat> Entering new area. Okay. I have to escort him. Yeah, this is this is pretty bad. Oh my god. I hope we don't have to do this too much. I think they only make you do it like two to three times or something, not like every bloody time. I think I think this guy dies, because I don't really... he's not a main character, for sure. Everybody else is, though. I mean, we got Shell, we got... yeah, he's a main character. Definitely a main character. And a main character as well. So, sir, buddy, you're gonna die. <clears throat> Someone should time that. Tell me exactly how long that took, because, jeez. Well, it's because it's going up, that's why. They can't just fall into it, I guess. Ooh, control room is coming up. Oh, yes. Uh, let's use the torpedo launcher. Actually, grenades. Yeah, well, you were spending like forever getting here, so. Okay, well we made it to uh, the control room, so uh, we're good to go. Right, guys? Go fire the weapon. Shell, seal the door in case there are more scavengers. Hey, this room looks pretty much untouched. The harvesters must not have made it this far. The crew must have stopped them. But it cost them their lives. Okay. Go to back. Fire it. Yeah, that's how it looks. It's kind of cool. 
Very small crew. These controls appear to be operational. Looks like we got plenty of time to spare. Finally, something went as planned. He's not even touching the control panel. Environmental integrity has been restored. You may now remove your helmets. I found something. Looks like an audio log. Can you play it back? Yeah. I'm processing it through the translator now. Help me! Help me! Ah! They're tearing through the hull! Our weapons are useless! I can't! The defense systems are cut off! We're going to be slaughtered! No! No! Get back! No! No! Ah! Somebody help us, please! They're killing us all! Tearing our ship apart! They're unstoppable! Ah! Oh my god. Distractions are not going to aid us in achieving our objectives. <gasps> that must have been the harvesters. Mr. Chell, control yourself. They're gonna tear Voyager apart. That is precisely what we are here to prevent. However, there has been a setback. Oh no. Yes, I spoke too soon. I can aim the gunship and fire it from here. But the loading mechanism seems to be malfunctioning. The charge will have to be loaded manually. Ensign Monroe, take a small team to the barrel here and ride the maintenance tram to the end. The plasma focusing router here is misaligned, cutting off power to the firing mechanism. You will have to adjust it. Then make your way down to the firing chamber. Once there, you have to load the energy round into the firing chamber. When you've loaded the charge, I will then be able to fire the gunship. All right, Chang, Satlos, you're with me. Chell, you and Telsia stay here. <sighs> I thought he was going to pick me. Hey, don't worry. The ship's deserted. Should be no problem. I have disabled all the security locks on the lifts and doors in the rest of the vessel. You should have no difficulties proceeding from here. We got uh, Ensign Expendable with us. <clears throat> he's, he's most, he has no personality, and so he's, he's kind of screwed. All right. This shouldn't be as bad now that we have less people. I would say that. Doesn't matter. As soon as we're done, we're beaming out of here. <laughs> They're always screaming at me. <clears throat> What's this? It's gonna kill you. Don't touch anything. Uh oh. Oh yeah. Mr. Monroe, what's happening down there? I'm reading a power surge. Oh, he doesn't actually melt. Uh, Mr. Monroe, what's your status? This ship isn't quite as dead as we thought. There were no indications of such a defense system here. They must be controlled from a different part of the ship. We'll just have to be careful. Agreed. Tuvok out. Yep, uh, setbacks all around. Maybe they're just maintenance bots. And we must be an infestation to them. Oh, look. Turrets. Oh, come on. There's so many of you robots. They're robots. Okay, that panel is nothing. Where's that turret? Oh. Alright. Switch back to this gun. I guess they're not following me. Yeah, be careful down there. Do everything by yourself. Oh, of course, of course, we're missing panels. Okay, we'll just press that. Don't even know what it does. Oh, I guess that's it. Opened it. Of course, they don't come down where it's actually hazardous and where they would be required to jump. Oh, and it went back. Wow. I like how you just stand on it and it goes back up. Thanks guys for the, all the help. Glad I brought you two on this uh, little mission here. God, I should just like go by myself. It's an- oh wait, look, it's an elevator. I'm gonna have to wait for them. 
Well, not when it's like two of them, though. You know, these are the most unthreatening enemies ever. I mean, they just stand there. The turrets are more damaging. Alright, let's go. <clears throat> well, they can't actually go in both at once, because it's just two of them. The skirmish. It sounds like it, we're going to have no trouble here, guys. I um, wish we could melt these things. It's so, it's so much more entertaining when you can do that. Uh, sure, let's go in here. Oh. Die. I get two with this, at least. What is this? It's a strange machine. Oh. I get this. I get this little baby now. Alright, um... Oh, it's just health and stuff. A lot of health, actually, so uh, I'm now getting wor kind of worried. And a grenade launcher is actually better. It does, like, splash. See, I killed both of them. Anybody home? Torpedoes like rockets. Like, very direct rockets. Uh-oh. This room seems kind of big. Why don't we just shoot those things? We know they're hostile. Yep. It's uh, Mech Warrior all over again. Uh, okay. And he's going straight after me. He's not very threatening. Uh, okay. <laughs> Didn't even hit you, so, you know, don't complain. Looks <laughs> like the only way to move on is down this lift where the robot came from. Oh no. It's giving me actually a lot of health, uh, and I'm playing on the hardest difficulty, so I'm not sure why I'm not having much trouble. I said I was gonna do this one. They, yeah, that, that's what they're good for. That's why I brought them along. They make good meat shields. Oh man, this grenade launcher is awesome. Dude, that thing's awesome. I don't get to kill it. These things are awesome, though. I like these robots. Although they're not very threatening at all. Uh, oh, there's there's something up there. I think I destroyed something. Oh, oh wait, there we go. I think there's something up here. Uh, I guess that was it. Oh. There we go. Little rewards for... Uh, <laughs> being kind of curious and uh... Oh, there's something more over here. Oh, nothing here though. Okay, let's keep going. What'd you pick up? An arc weapon. Kind of <laughs> this, this, this gun is totally sweet though. And you have a secondary fire of this laser, this lightning laser thing. It's just the best uh, weapon that uses the uh... Uh, the, the pick stuff. Oh crap. Two of you guys. Which, you guys are highly not damaging. Uh, we'll just go to the arc weapon. I love the arc weapon. That's so cool. Oh, turrets. Oh, they die in like one hit, so. Thanks, thanks a lot, guys, for not helping. Uh, you make it up there. Oh, you can. Sweet. 
Uh, anything? Well, it looks like a staircase, but I doubt very much it is. Time to figure out the next puzzle. We've got to get up there somehow. Yeah, probably like this. <laughs> I know it looks kind of cheesy, but uh, you know, what can you say? What is this? Oh, it hurts me. Well, that's not good. Alright, <laughs> back up we go. I like this gun a lot. This and the Arc Welder are probably my two favorites in this game. Um, and maybe the occasional time I actually get a knife and it's useful. But just that there's so many enemies. I need, I probably need a better hotkey. Whoa, they fire me. They dodge too. All right, let's go back and grab that health. No, don't close. Okay. Where's this? Oh, I think I was up here at one point. Yeah, yeah, we're just we're just like now heading back through things. Oh, look, another elevator. Excellent, Monroe. You are approaching the barrel. The tram should be nearby. Take it down to the plasma focusing chamber. You must hurry. I don't think you get any weapons beyond this. Oh man, the bear looks sweet. It's kind of like a Death Star kind of thing. Yeah, hey, like we're all we look like we're in such a rush to save the ship. <laughs> Just casually walking. Wait, I thought I was the leader. Why don't I get to press buttons? Okay. Attunement. Well, guys, we're finally here. Last one's off. It's a rotten egg. Uh, it's it's that guy Chang. <laughs> oh, well, we can't go through there. Careful. That looks like superheated ion gas. It sear the flesh right off your bones. Well, it looks like you guys aren't coming with me again. Alright. It's kinda hard to hit them. And they also blow up, so... I don't know what to deal with that is. Alright, let's figure out what the puzzle here is. This is supposed to kill us on this thing. Or maybe we're supposed to follow that. Or no, wait, I think that's, uh... Okay, we're supposed to make it down there somehow. Uh... There's a way to get down there. No, that's not it. <clears throat> nope. It's, it's always some puzzle where you shoot something. Uh, yeah, because this thing leads all the way back to that. Whoa, no, I didn't really mean to go down there. Please send me back up. Oh, wait. Aha. Uh -huh. And there's a solution to our problems, folks. Screw you, scavengers. firing at me. Oh, you are. Okay, I'm guessing we just... Yeah, we just blew them all up. And it's off! Hey, Monroe. Whatever you did worked. The gas stopped venting. Whatever I did worked. It's, it was probably me destroying uh, stuff. I could, could, it could have like blown up the ship for all I know. Oh, these guys, that will one hit them. Oh, I think it goes through enemies too. Oh, not really. Well, kinda. 
Doesn't instantly kill them though. I thought I hit that guy like three times already. <laughs> Alright. We must be getting close to focusing to How do you know? Yeah, ignore everybody else. <laughs> I'll look at another one. Will you attack my teammates? That is unlikely. Well, you know, then again, I think I would go after the guy with, with the grenade launcher. Oh. Yeah, let's go to Arc Welder. He's gonna steal so much fun. Alright, and we're now running out of ammunition for it. So I probably can't use it that much. But we have more now. It's it's giving me just about to keep using it. I guess it got the focusing thing involved. I wonder if it, this does as much damage. Yeah. No, it does five. How's this one? Oh. I want to kind of see what's over here, actually. What's over here? Okay. The Gravitic whatever. Hey, I got them all. Oh, look, it's another jumping puzzle. Wee. Although it's kind of fun fighting low grab. Oh, I see. The, the vine actually goes farther. There we go. It's dead. Alright, and get him. The thing is, if you if you miss, you uh, don't really get a second chance. So you have to be extremely accurate with it. But if you hit him like set, like within two times, then it's, it's actually still worthwhile to use. Oh, I just gave him an elevator. I feel like they actually ran. I get, like they have a sense of urgency. <laughs> They're so lazy. Alright, open says me. Go. Go open it. The door's locked, sir. Tuvok said he disabled all the security locks. Too bad Chell isn't here. There's some micro fissures in the door structure. I think I can move them. <laughs> okay. Take cover. Yeah, you stand there and say that. And we're we're like all away from it anyway. I wouldn't be much of a demolitionist if I couldn't blow up the door. Well you could that, that was the only door you could blow up. <laughs> Alright. Let's go. I kind of want to just fix that thing up and then uh, we'll call it up for today. I, I have this thing where I'm really going over time with this. Yeah, I don't know. I don't think we're going to make it there. I don't know why I keep making these epic episodes and likes for this game. I just really like playing it. Oh, I actually hear it, so never mind. Makes a lot of noise too. Well, no no kidding. There we go, realigns. Okay. Oh, this guy right here. Tomorrow we'll finish this up and uh, load the charge and hopefully destroy this guy's ship. So, you guys have a good one. See you later. Bye.